welcome. This is Dee from Crystal Crafts with Dee. I have another unboxing to do for you today. This one is from New Craft Day. So they contacted me and asked me if I would like to do another review on their products. And I said, of course. Uh, they're a budget-friendly um, website and they have all sorts of crafts and pretty much anything you can think of on there. They got a lot to choose from and they got really good pricing as well. So I've chosen a couple of different bits and pieces in here and I will get started. I've just started the bag a little bit. And it comes in your standard plastic bag and hopefully I've got enough daylight because it's... I think it's going to rain. Anyway, let's see how we go. So I have three items in here. Take them over there. Uh, I have two diamond paintings and a cross stitch. So I might start off with this one because this one doesn't have a cover on it. So when I saw this, I thought, oh, that is so pretty. It's got the prettiest reds and greens and just really pretty colors. There we go. So this one is a 30 by 40 diamond painting. It is a full round drill. We'll get these guys out of here first. You've got your canvas, you've got a standard tool kit, and um, some drills. So, yeah, I saw this and I thought, oh, that's actually really, really pretty. And I love birds. It's a beautiful um, birds and, oops, and red flowers. And I just thought that was so cute. So what I will do is, just to help it flatten out a bit, just pull that plastic back and put it back on top. And what that does is it helps the canvas to relax and straighten out. And then I'll put it under a couple of books for a week or two and it'll be right as rain. So I'm not concerned about it being crinkly like that. It doesn't worry me at all. It will flatten out. So there you go. Isn't that just the prettiest? I just love that image. So pretty. I love the colors. I love these big beautiful flowers and you got your two gorgeous little birds sitting on the fence post and your bits of green in there too. It just looks so pretty. So this has 22 colors in it and it looks really good actually. So I don't think I need a light pad. I think it'd be all right like that. Anyway, I will zoom you in. You can have a closer look. So in we go. So just looking at that drill field, you do have some darker colors in there, but um, it looks like the lettering is easy to see. So I'm not seeing any real dramas. It's a bit messy in here. Um, like you've got X's, X's and P's and G's and stuff. A little bit messy in there, but you know, it's no big deal. Off we go. There's your other little bird. And up the top, we've got a thumbnail up there. It's hard to see. There we go. And there are two symbol keys. You've got one on each side. So I'm just going to look there. So they are all, um, capital letters. Um, you have your um, DMC cross-reference as well. I think they look okay. I don't think there's really any issues with that. So I'll bring you down into the middle again. But that looks really good. All right, I'll zoom you back out again. There we go. And we'll have a look at those drills. Drills come in... Standard packet. Um, oh, okay. We've sprung a leak. I hope I don't have any open bags in here because that's going to be not fun. No, oh, looks okay. Uh, right, so these guys are all the little teeny tiny packets. These little tiny ones. I am really not a fan of these. I don't like them. Um, they're just a bit of a pain to deal with. Um, the lettering's dark as well, so if your drills are dark, it's hard to see the DMC codes. But I can see that. That's fine. That's nice and easy. I can see that. So it's no real issue. So they are well marked. Just got some beautiful colors there. 
Oh, all these little bits and pieces everywhere. Browns and grays. And you've got some lovely oranges and green. Red. Nice red that. More reds. Black, green. I'm um, just having a bit of a quick look here. They actually look good, those oh, drills. Oh, oh. They look really good. Oh boy. I have to tell my kid to keep it down. You know, kids in their Sony PlayStation stuff. And last but not least, purple. So what I do when I kit these sorts of um, projects up is I start off with um, just putting them in piles. So that's a 400 that goes there. That's 452 goes in the 400s. 647 goes in the 600 pile. Uh, I can't even read that one. 154, so he goes in the 100s. Um, 315, he goes in the 300s. And so I put them in piles like that, and then um, I just sort of start from the top uh, there, and then I just kit them up uh, according to your DMC color. So that's how I sort of do that. Um, yeah, but that's, that's a lot of little colors. I'm not a fan of these um, little bags, but anyway, the drills look really good, so I'm happy about that. That's the important thing. All right, so we'll grab all those, and oh, we got another one. I'll have to check that. It might have just a little tiny hole in it. So I'll pop them all in there. Yep, that does the job. <laughs> So that is gorgeous little bluebirds and red flowers diamond painting. That is going to look so pretty. That's going to look so good. Alrighty, on to the next one. So this one here is, this one comes in a padded bag. Let's work it in there. So this is a, should be a 30 by 30. Oh my gosh, I can't get that. There we go. This is a 30 by 30. Um, so the canvas is actually a lot thinner than the other one. Uh, you've got your standard tool kit. Beautiful drills. And the canvas. Ooh. So if you've been watching my channel, you will know that I am very partial to mandalas i love mandalas um i try not to oversaturate my channel with mandalas but sometimes i can't help myself because there's just so many to choose from you just you know i like them all i don't know i don't know which one i'm going to choose but anyway i like this because it has some really interesting things going on in it so i'll put it right side up there we go uh, 30 by 30, again, I'm not concerned. Those wrinkles will come out. And there are 15 different drills in there. And look how beautiful and colorful that is. I just thought, wow, that's like so colorful. And what drew me to it was, well, the colors. And I like these things that go around the edging. I love the center. And I like these little bits in the corner. I think they look really cool. So I'm like, yep. I need to get that. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Shush. 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 Okay, sorry about that, but the neighbor was putting her bins out, and apparently that's a big deal, and the dog needs to bark. So, sorry about that. <laughs> anyway, where was I? This beautiful mandala. 15 different um, drills. It is super duper beautifully printed. I am loving these canvases that we're seeing now because they are just so crisp and sharp with these um, printed drills and printed drill field. Oh golly. Okay, in we go. I'll show you the drill field. So look how beautiful and clear that is. It's just amazing, isn't it? It looks just amazing just like that without any drills on it. So I just love those um, and there'll be beautiful teardrops around that um, those areas. I like these little um, frills. I think they look really cool. There's two symbol keys, one on each side. But that looks absolutely beautiful. Look how sharp those symbols are. 
just beautifully printed. And then coming around here, I'll show you this symbol key. So you got your symbol, just your standard dashes and triangles, etc. We've got some rounds and a couple of different teardrops, so that'll be pretty cool. But that looks really good, no issues at all reading those symbols. All right, I'll zoom you back out again. We'll have a look at those drills. So the drills come in a standard strip. So they are clearly marked, so color number one, which is your beautiful clear rhinestones. And gee, they look beautiful. Really nice backs on those, they look really good. Beautiful clear. Got a couple of strips. So how many are there? Fifteen. So of your rhinestones, you've got a gorgeous green. Have a look at that color. I don't know if that's coming up on camera really well, but oh, it's just the most beautiful green. Really pretty green. Beautiful light blue. Gorgeous pink. That one's got a couple of scratched backs, but I'm not seeing many, so that looks pretty good. You've got red rhinestone, purple rhinestones, yellow rhinestones. They look really, really good. Got some larger red domes. That beautiful blue. Gosh, that's gorgeous. And look at the, the backs. Like there's one that's got a mark on it, but the rest of them so far look really, really good. And the second strip, there's some yellow domes. Oh, look at that pink. Wow like an ice pink that is gorgeous and look at the sparkle have a look at these teardrops holy moly oh my goodness they are just gorgeous so they got like the extra facets cut in them and then they have these little bit of AB on there so it's picking up bits of pink and bits of purple that is gorgeous got some frosted teardrops and some AB coated white domes so they look really really good beautiful drills beautiful colors so what have we got that's up to 15 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 so they're all there and look at those beautiful colors that is just going to be amazing oh just can't get over those blues Beautiful, beautiful drills. Absolutely gorgeous. That is going to be so pretty. So those teardrops, what color is he? He is 13. So that's the blue. Oh, so those beautiful um, faceted teardrops go all the way around there. Oh, that is going to be gorgeous. Wow, that's going to be stunning. Good use of color too, beautiful colors. So that's my 30 by 30 mandala. It's absolutely gorgeous. I haven't done a sticky test for a while, have I? No, that's, gee, that's super sticky. And the birds. That's super sticky as well. Beautiful. Really good quality, these canvases and the drills. Okay, and last but not least, I have a cross stitch. So this is a Joy Sunday cross stitch. Uh, it's a wolf spirit. Um, this is one I've been wanting to get for a long time, and I just keep putting it on the back burner, and I thought, you know what, I'm going to get it this time. I just love the use of colors and everything in it. It's just well done. Uh, this is on 14 count. Where are we 14 count? Use two strands and it's 19 by 27 centimeters, so it's a perfect size. This is a great beginner's project. So, Joy Sunday, they come in these really nice um, Ziploc bags, and you've got all your directions on the back on how to cross stitch and how to wash your. Um, Wash your canvas when you're done with it. So these are very good directions. 
works is very good for keeping your projects separate and for keeping them dust free and dirt free so there's your cover sheet there but I just I love it I think it's really really nice good use of colors doesn't look like there's any back stitch in there but I think the coloring is very effective just beautiful so you've got your graph and your thumbnail so you've got your graph on the back and your thumbnail and there are there are Uh, there's 30 full stitches colors in there um, so you've got your symbols there and you've got your DMC cross reference and the symbols that are on your chart the chart is a very good reference so if you got symbols that look a little bit similar um, you can always cross reference it on your chart it is very easy to read but that is really gorgeous so 30 30 colors that's that's a lot for that size it's only a little guy it's a beautiful colors and there you go it's so little it's just so cute oh I love it this is a perfect beginners project uh, it has enough to keep you busy 30 colors in a canvas that size is just fabulous um, it's just great so this is perfect you do have some larger areas that you will need to to do and then you've got you do have a little bit of confetti going on which is not surprising because you do have your 30 colors but you do have these sort of larger areas if you don't want to get into the details and you just want to um, you know just feel like doing chunks big chunks you can just go to town on those and then when you feel like getting into the details you can get in there and um, get some of those out so down the bottom there are your symbols and all the way down there to rip <laughs> so uh, that's kind of hard to read but anyway you have your chart so it is 80 stitches by 108 stitches and as with all joy Sunday products they have your hand edging this is quite stiff this canvas quite stiff but the size is perfect there's no back stitch and this is perfect to travel with uh, it would sit nice and flat in your suitcase because you can put it in your um, like it's not gonna fold in your ziplock bag that it comes in it just sits flat like that so that would take no room in your um, suitcase or your carry-on um, but yeah those colors Wow, it looks like there's a lot going on there, <laughs> but it's going to look awesome. 30 colors, you're going to get beautiful, beautiful shading. So I'm really impressed with that, and I love the size. I think it's fantastic. Perfect size. And being 14 count, you use two strands. It looks really good. So I'm just having a look. I'll bring it up a bit closer. So you can see how that's printed. The printing looks pretty good to me, actually. Looks really, really good. So I will probably need to reference that chart a few times just to make sure I'm picking up the right color. But that looks really good. And there's your symbols down there. That looks awesome. So it is a partial, so you don't actually stitch that bit there. Um, yeah, so that's that's pretty good I don't think I'd stitch that sometimes when it's a partial um, it can kind of look a little bit funny not being stitched but this is sort of that will look fine not being stitched but that looks awesome oh wow I'm super impressed and it's, it's so small <laughs> it's so little what was it it was uh, 19 centimeters by 27 centimeters so that is a great traveling project that is fabulous all right we'll have a look at those colors so you have they give you two needles there you go two needles and your threads come pre-sorted on this card they're very clearly marked no issues at all with that and is marked 14 count two strands 
Let's have a look at these colors. They're going to be beautiful, beautiful browns. Some red browns, beiges, grays. That looks a bit like a bit pink. So these threads feel really good. They're nice and long. Beautiful colors. And the other side, got these lovely soft, lovely soft colors. Beautiful beiges. Beiges and browns and grays, cream. Yeah, and they feel really good actually. Beautiful and soft. Nice and long, beautiful and soft, and absolutely gorgeous colors. Look at that. Beautiful. So you're going to get some absolutely gorgeous shading in that wolf. So that is the wolf spirit. That is just gorgeous. So I'll probably get started on that one pretty quick, actually. But it's good. There's no back stitch. Four stitches only. That looks amazing. Oh, wow. I'm really excited about that. So beautiful. Okay, so that is my latest package that I got from New Craft Day. I have one absolutely gorgeous cross stitch. I have a beautiful mandala. Oh boy, I can't wait to start that one. And these gorgeous bluebirds and the red flowers. Three very different items there for you today. Uh, I'd like to thank New Craft Day very much for sending these out to me for review. Um, I'm really looking forward to getting started on these guys and um, keep your eyes peeled for those in the not too distant future because I'll be doing videos on those uh, soon. So um, I will also link these products in the description box below if you're interested in them. And um, yep, that is just gorgeous. Really looking forward to doing that. So thank you so much for watching my video and thank you very much new craft day for sending these out to me and i will see you next time